So check this out guys, we are back on the Night Village of Extreme Speed. My voice has got so much better over the last 24 hours and I can finally almost, not quite, but almost speak properly again guys. So uh, I can't wait to produce some videos over the next couple of days with my normal voice back. It has been lost for a while, but it's coming, it's coming. So check this out. Yesterday we unlocked, of course, the new hero inside of COC, the Night Village, the second village, the Battle Machine. And we're actually going to be jamming him all the way from level 1 to max level in this episode right now. And then of course we're also going to do another bit of a gem spree, gem up some other defenses in the base, get ourselves into some live attacks and we're going to check out what the brand new hero ability can actually do. So just before we do that guys, I promised I would show you my method to get some free gems inside of COC. Now this does take a while. It's not, you know, instant free gems. It does take a while, but if you have some spare time and you want to get yourself some free gems, if you want to buy yourself a pocket full of gems, a pile of gems, a bag of gems, completely for free, this is a great method to do so. So there is a link down below, straight at the bottom of the description box, guys. Click the link. You should be able to see it really easy. Go ahead and click that link, and it's going to take you over to a site where you can download a new app. So once you've downloaded the app, it will come up on your device as Misplay, which is the app right at the bottom, which you can see on screen right now. Now, because the app doesn't come directly from an app store, your device won't actually trust it. So you need to do this before you can get yourself some free gems. Simply go into your settings, click on the general tab, scroll all the way down to the bottom, click device management, click unsteaming, and then click misplay, and it will ask you to trust the app. All you need to do is hit the trust button, and then you can go ahead and get yourself some free gems. So once you've trusted the app, guys, simply go on to misplay, and the world is your oyster. You can start to download some games, download some apps, and you pretty much collect points, and then once you've collected points, you can go ahead and spend them. Now, if you want to get yourself some free points, guys, if you do want to use my code, it is on screen right there. My invite code is capital G, capital T, GT93. I'm going to get some points if you use my code and you'll get some points also. The points you guys give me will be used to do some gemming inside of future episodes and basically entertain you on the channel. So yes, if you do use the code down below in the description box, guys, it does really help me out. It allows me to get some extra gems to make videos and, you know, you get some free gems as well. So go ahead, check out the apps once you've got yourself some points. So you can see top right hand side of the screen, I've actually got just under 19,000 points. And I'm going to go ahead and buy, let's buy two gift cards. I'm going to buy an iTunes and an Android gift code, which I'm going to hide in this episode right now. So let's go ahead and get an iTunes code. $10, let's order that. So we've just clicked the order button, guys, and order complete success. Your order is being processed. You'll receive your gift card via the email within the next 48 hours. So there we go. It's as simple as that. And then we're also going to order a $10 Google Play gift card, and the exact same thing will happen. So there we go. Those two gift cards will be hidden in this episode, so make sure you keep your eyes open. Good luck to every single one of you. So let's go back, guys. And uh, pretty much that, that concludes it. If you want to get some free gems, use my invite code GT93. Make sure you do capital letters, guys. Capital G, capital T, 93. So here we go, back on the Night Village of Extreme Speed. By the way, if you've made it this far into the episode, I want to say thank you for the constant support you guys are showing. Using things like my invite codes really does help me and allows me to get some free gems as well inside of this game, guys. So I cannot thank you enough. But let's do this. Let's max out this battle machine and let's see what he can do once he reaches max level and we get a new level ability. So we're going to go into the treasury, completely fill up the, uh, the elixir, 1,332 gems. Now we also need to get ourselves our builder. That's currently upgrading the archer tower, 53 gems and there we go, level 3 archer tower. So here we go, let's do this, 1 million elixir. Can we get 1 million likes on the episode? Let's try that guys. Smash that like button if you've made it this far into the video. And let me know what your thoughts are on this new hero. The new battle machine. Is he better than the Barbarian King? Is he better than the Archer Queen? Is he better than the Grand Warden? Four heroes currently in the game. Let me know down below what is your current favorite hero. Once we get this to level 5, we'll find out guys how good this hero actually is. So let's just straight up gem him. Going to take him straight to level 4, and I believe it is only one more level. But before we do that, 
I think we actually need to upgrade our elixir storages. So let's find that. Where is the elixir storage? Here we go. Elixir storage. That one's already maxed out, guys. Just need to max out this one here. And there we go. So we got two level five elixir storages. And that's going to allow us to buy completely maxed out treasure. So let's go back. Let's grab gold back into the shop. Treasury. Let's grab elixir. And that's going to leave us with just 8,000 gems. So we've already spent like 40,000 gems on this village. It's been pretty damn insane. And the final level for the battle machine, guys. 1.3 million elixir. It's about to go to level 5. 499 gems. And there we go. He is maxed out so far. There is going to be some new levels coming once another update does come out, guys. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Don't forget we're doing a 1.7 million subscriber giveaway. We are giving away a MacBook Pro, a Yeti microphone, and a HD recorder so that one of you, my subscribers, can actually also become a YouTuber. If you want the chance to win, simply sub to the channel. That is all you need to do. The level 5 battle machine, guys. Let's do this. We've got ourselves some giants, the battle machine, and some archers. Hoping to wreck a base. Let's find out. This is going to be the first time we've ever used this brand new hero ability. Now, I think you can actually use the hero ability multiple times inside of a battle. So this is going to be pretty damn insane, guys. I'm, I'm looking forward to this. So uh, let's go ahead and find a battle. So check it out. We've landed on a village. And it is, I think... I think that's a Builder Hall level 4. I'm not really 100% sure, but I believe it is level 4. Now, we're just going to drop some archers just to pick off those buildings on the left there. We're also going to pick off some more buildings on the, uh, sorry, on the right. And we're also going to pick off the buildings on the left. And I think we're going to be attacking from the bottom, bottom hand side. Maybe around these, uh, these troops. So, let's just do this, guys. So let's go in with the giants. There goes the, uh, that brand new hero. And we got all those archers in just behind. Level 5 hero. Let's find out what he can do. Let's just straight up use his ability. We're going to use it in a second. Here we go. He's going to take out that cannon. And we're going to use his ability. The battle machine ability on the crusher. There goes the king's ability. Not the king, sorry. The battle machine's ability. And he took out that crusher so quickly. That was unbelievable, guys. And check it out. His ability is actually recharging. And we can use it again right now. There it goes again. And he summons the thunder and crushes these bases. Damn. Is this guy unstoppable? Is this too OP? Who knows? The battle machine has made it all the way to the end. And we can even use his ability one more time. Three times inside of a single battle, guys. There goes the final building. The perfect triple star. And uh, I think it's pretty much guaranteed we won that. So let's find out. Did he beat me? Let's find out, guys. He's still attacking. Unfortunately, we cannot watch live attacks from the opponent. But we're going to wait for that to end. And then we're going to see what happens. So we've got this builder free. And I've also got a free boost on the uh, on the clock tower. So let's use the free boost. And let's see what we can upgrade. we got 900,000 gold. I think we're going to upgrade the barrack, guys. But you haven't spent the gold. Let's spend the gold on some walls. And then we will upgrade the barracks. Here we go. So let's just literally go around this base. Upgrading as many walls as possible. It is co costing, uh, what is it, 100,000 a piece. So it's quite expensive. But it's going to give us much better level walls, guys. Now we've also got some wall level 1s. And we're going to upgrade these ones first because they're a lot cheaper. And then we're going to do the rest of the walls, which are already level 2. And send them to level 3. So we can upgrade a couple more. Let's just do um, let's do this one here. This is going to be the final wall. And check it out. That's what the base looks like currently. We've pretty much got every building down on the map. Apart from, I think, a few defenses. So we still got some defenses. But we'll be building them later on in another episode. So just stay tuned for that. So there we go, we got the victory. They only got a 50% two star, but we crushed them using that brand new hero, the battle machine. And it's time to get ourselves into another live attack. Level five hero, let's do this guys. The exact same strategy as before. Giants to tank, archers behind, and of course the battle machine to slay the crusher and all those other beastly defenses. And check it out, we have landed on our new base and the dude is called Pursue. He's actually got the triple mortar. And um, it looks like a scary base, but I believe we can do this. So, where should we attack from this time? 
I think we're going to leave the Crusher for now, guys. And uh, I think we're going to attack from the right-hand side, just like before, and try and take out these buildings as quickly as we can. So there we go. Giant Mine did go off, but uh, didn't really do loads and loads of damage. We do have that Hero's ability. We're going to use it in a second because, of course, it does recharge. Let's just wait for him. There we go. There goes the Hero's ability. He's going to summon that Thunder once again and completely crush the majority of these buildings. Unfortunately, loads of my archers have kind of been attacked, but the hero, the battle machine, is still in action, and there goes his ability one more time. He's going to crush those buildings, literally wrecking this base. Every single one of these defenses is getting ripped apart. The cannon on the left-hand side is about to go down. There he goes, guys. The hero does go down, but not before that archer tower. Damn, it just about survives. But we still cleared 55% total damage. And uh, I'm sure it was maybe just about enough to get us to victory. Let's find out. The archer's going to take out the archer. Nope, didn't work. And uh, that's going to leave us with a 59% two-star. So the opponent is still attacking. Let's find out, guys. Pursue is still attacking. Pursue. 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 I don't even know how to pronounce that. But there we go. 50% destroyed. Is he going to beat me? He needs to get 59. This is going to be close. So we're still waiting on him to attack, guys. So we are going to end this episode here. There we go. No, he got a 65% two-star. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. Okay, in the next episode, just to let you guys know, we will be unlocking every other troop which is available in the game, which I believe is possibly just the cannon. We will be unlocking the final cannon, guys, the cannon car in the second episode coming in a couple of hours' time. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Leave a like on the episode if you made it all the way to the end. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you shortly. Peace out.